Welcome back everyone. In this video I'm going to be going into more detail about the basics of creating your very first robot and what robots actually have, the elements comprised of them. So if we look here at our robots, Walls and My First Bot, you can see at the top they have a gun. Okay, and they also have a radar, this little dish here. Now they can move independently, but they can also move together. So when you turn your gun, you also turn your radar. And your radar is used to detect other robots and also other obstacles on the field such as bullets. You also have your wheels here. Now movement is also a big part. You can, you can move anywhere on the field. And at the top here we have this number, that is your energy. Now your energy does two things, it is your health, so when your energy hits zero, your bot loses. And also when you make any movements, such as firing a bullet, it will take a cost off this energy, so the larger the bullet, the more cost it takes off. So let's have a look at our code. Here we can see a basic outline of the code on the RoboWiki and I'm going to be going through this for you. So if we have a look at our code here, we've got our package. This is very basic stuff. And we're going to import our robot libraries. So in this one we're going to be using the robot and the scanned robot event. Now because we are making a robot, we need to extend the robot class. And when the game chooses to run your robot, it invokes this run method. And what we are doing here is while this is true, we're going to move ahead 100 spaces. We're going to turn our gun 360 degrees right. So we're going to turn it all the way around. And because our, our scanner, our radar, is on top of the gun, it is also going to turn the radar 360 degrees and search for any robots. And when it finds a robot, we're going to invoke this on scanned robot event. And we're going to fire, fire a bullet of one energy in the direction of where we found the robot. Then we're going to go back 100 spaces and we're going to repeat the action. We're going to turn our gun and radar 360 degrees around and if we see a robot anywhere in those degrees, we're going to shoot and then continue scanning till we've finished that action. Now because we are in a loop here, this is just going to happen again and again and again. Very simple stuff. Let's see it in action again. So this is our bot here. You can see it move forward 100 spaces, turn 360 degrees right, and move back. And as it turns 360 degrees, when it detects this wall, this wall's robot, it shoots a bullet in that direction. Now we're not being very accurate because the wall's robot is moving. By the time our bullet gets there, the robot has moved. And you can see we just lost there. So in the next video, we're going to be having a look at different movement techniques. Thank you.